welcome to or back to my channel so today I'm back with a super exciting video so today I'm gonna do a video all about my winter clothing essentials so I did one of these for back to school and I also did one of these for the fall so I thought it was fitting to do one of these for the winter time I feel like I have so many clothing essentials for the winter um, especially for outerwear but also just clothing in general and then of course accessories so that's what I'm gonna be talking about in this video so just talking about some of the current trends for the winter season like there's a lot of trends that i've been seeing on instagram youtube pinterest so i'll be referencing those as well i'll link my fall video below and i'll also put it here in the corner if you guys want to check it out because i feel like a lot of the fall clothing essentials can also apply to the winter i have a list in my phone um my case is from case to five if you guys are curious um i actually do have a 20 percent off link with case to five i will link that below um i love case to five cases they're just so cute and they are very protective i do have a list of all my winter essentials and trends on my phone so i might be glancing here a little bit throughout this video before we get into the video make sure you guys are subscribed if you're not subscribed turn on the notification bell so you can be notified whenever i post make sure to follow me on instagram at emilygrace.26 definitely make sure to thumbs up this video if you'd like to see more fashion content like this make sure to comment below your favorite winter essentials or even just some of your favorite trends right now i would love to hear what your essentials are so definitely comment down below or even just like your favorite places to shop let's just go ahead and get started with the video first things first um i have different categories so bottoms tops outerwear and accessories so i think i'm going to start with the bottoms if you guys have seen any of my outfit ideas i actually just posted winter outfit ideas so definitely make sure to check that out i have almost 20 outfit ideas in that and they're all like cold weather outfit ideas if you guys have seen any of my outfit ideas you would know that I pretty much wear a lot of jeans. I don't really wear skirts or dresses or even just like pants. That sounds weird, but I don't really wear pants very often, like actual dressy pants or anything. I pretty much wear jeans every single day. Just literally not going anywhere. I'll wear like leggings or sweatpants, but I pretty much wear jeans every day. So jeans are obviously my essential, my favorite jeans. Currently, I might do a new and updated like favorite jeans video because I do have this video right here I'll, I'll link it um, which is a whole video on my favorite jeans It's like I think it's my top 10 favorite jeans and I would say that video is still Pretty accurate the jeans in the video are still definitely some of my favorites and like literally jeans I'm wearing right now are in that video but I have some new favorites that aren't in that video so definitely let me know in the comments if you would like to see an updated top 10 favorite jeans video a jean collection would honestly be too much because my jean collection is out of control but I mean I do it if you guys really want to see it that's kind of a side note but currently I would say my favorites are my Abercrombie jeans if you've watched again if you've watched any of my recent videos you've definitely seen them I think they were like the only pair of jeans I showed in my last couple outfit ideas they were like the pair of jeans I was wearing throughout the whole like with every outfit those Abercrombie jeans are definitely my favorite I'll link them below I've got a couple different pairs that I bought they're like the 90s ultra high rise straight or something along those lines and i got a couple different ones like a couple different washes um and i've just been wearing them all so much i think i might have to get another one in like a faded black i also love the jamie jeans from top shop or the american eagle super high rise they're pretty much the exact same thing um i really love those those are just a great high-waisted tight jigging type of jean that you could just wear with anything when i have an oversized sweatshirt or just they're just great to throw on with anything. So I love the Princess Polly crisscross jeans. They're baggy, they're comfortable, they're high-waisted, they're trendy with the little crisscross, and they're pretty affordable too. So um, those are probably my top three favorites right now. I definitely have other favorites, but those are probably my three go-tos. I guess four, but the Jamie and Super Harris are like the same. Um, so jeans are definitely my number one bottom essential. Also sweatpants and joggers. I have been loving this pair. So I have this pair of sweatpants from a local brand where I live. I've talked about this brand in so many videos, but the brand is 96. Um, I'm actually really good friends with the owner. She's like the nicest person ever. She actually just opened a shop here in Kansas City. Follow her Instagram at shop96 um, for more details, but definitely even if you don't live here, just check out her website um, shop96.com um, but I recently got a pair of sweatpants from her I'll show you guys a picture or like a try on or something 
um they're like a nice green color and they say 96 which is just so cute but they are so comfortable they're literally like the most comfortable sweatpants they're so soft i got them in a medium because i don't like my sweatpants to fit like too tight or anything so i got them in a medium and they fit so good i also love leggings leggings are also just a really good go-to i feel like leggings are also nice um sometimes if it's really really cold out i put leggings under my jeans as like an extra layer which might sound weird but like some days it's like in the negative temperatures and if i'm gonna be like out i would do this just if i was like walking to class because i had you know, I would have to like go pretty far in between my classes and I'd have to park like 10 minutes away and I would be like really cold. So I would wear leggings underneath my jeans. Um, and I like the Align leggings from Lululemon. They're just nice and tight and they're like lightweight, but they're still like warm and I don't know, they're just perfect. They're really good for layering. They're also really good for just like lounging and they're comfy and they'd probably be good for working out too. I wouldn't know. Just I love the Lululemon line leggings, but the Wonder Under are good too. Love uh, Aloe Yoga's leggings and workout sets. I feel like leggings are definitely a must, just to wear with like oversized sweatshirts. Also said leather pants or even leather leggings, like faux leather leggings. I feel like that look is super in right now. I don't really have any. I bought the really like famous Aritzia ones, but I was kind of in between sizes. The I think I got a four and a six, and the six was like really gappy in the waist, but the four is kind of like too tight in my thighs. I'm like, I hardly ever leave the house, so I couldn't really justify for how expensive they were when I hardly ever go anywhere. I'm like, I probably won't actually wear these anywhere because I never go anywhere. I didn't end up keeping them, but those ones are really, really cute if you're looking for a good pair. They honestly, they're a really good fit. I was just kind of in between sizes, but they are like a really good style because they're kind of like a straight leg and then lastly for bottoms i said plaid pants um just kind of like trousers I got a pair from princess polly and i also got a pair from forever 21 and they're both really really cute These plaid pants are really cute with like a sweater and like some boots so definitely think plaid pants would be super cute for the winter they're all my bottom essentials um so moving on to top the first one i bet you guys can guess if you watch a lot of my videos is mock necks and turtlenecks i literally love mock necks i wear them every single day of the winter i think they're really cute to layer with and they're also really warm when it's cold i don't want to have just a sweatshirt on i like having that extra layer it just feels way warmer um so i just love mock necks and turtlenecks i feel like they are such an essential to layer with or just to wear on their own they're super cute i feel like there's so many places to get them I have a bunch from brandy melville that i got like a couple years ago and those just seem to be the ones that i'm constantly wearing because i like the fit of them better than my other ones to be perfectly honest i have one from h&m that i really like i have some from boohoo that i really like i have some from forever 21 that i really like i will link some of my favorite ones down in the description next up is just like a good sweater i know that's like the most basic winter piece so i'm not like telling you anything new um but i do love it just like chunky oversized kind of sweaters i feel like princess polly has really good ones um american eagle you know they have good ones just got some from forever 21 next up is hoodies and crew neck sweatshirts i know that's also just such a basic essential but i wanted to mention it so i could tell you just like some of my favorite places to get them definitely princess polly um boohoo has really cute graphic sweatshirts and they're really affordable as well i thought about doing like a hoodie or sweatshirt collection video but it would take me so long to film i have more hoodies than the size of this clothing rack like hoodies alone not even sweatshirts i have like a ridiculous hoodie collection from Brandy Melville just like from years and years of shopping there I feel like they're just so comfortable so I wear them a lot Urban Outfitters as well I have a bunch of really cute I don't think I actually have it on my clothing rack anymore I just wore it the other day tie-dye crew neck sweatshirts you've probably seen me wear them in like a bunch of videos they're from Urban Outfitters they are so soft but next up is sweater vests i love sweater vests i am like literally loving the sweater vest trend let me know if you guys are loving it as well i've done a poll on my instagram and it was like 70 percent of people did not like the sweater vest trend but i feel like people are starting to like it more i love the sweater vest trend i 
recently got one at Forever 21, H&M, and I'm trying to think where else. Princess Polly has some cute ones as well. I think especially with a mock neck underneath or just like an oversized t-shirt underneath. I think they're so, so cute. If you don't have a sweater vest, you should definitely pick one up because they are such a cute trend. Next up is probably one of my favorite trends. It is a shacket. They are warm, they're cute. So basically kind of like a flannel but it's warmer so it's really good for those days where it's cold but it's not cold enough for a coat but you need something to kind of keep you warm the shacket is perfect they're really really cute so i've actually seen some cute ones at american eagle also got some from forever 21 so you can pretty much get these anywhere i think they are really really cute it's actually the last top i could really list off winter tops all day but i kind of wanted to just pick a few of my favorites so this video wasn't like too long a chunky cardigan would be a really good essential i was looking on my pinterest and i just saw so many um pictures that i had pinned of just like really thick chunky cardigans and i feel like i wear cardigans all the time in the winter so that's all for the tops um but now going to outerwear outerwear in itself is like the biggest essential for the winter so really can't have winter without outerwear so Anyways, my first essential for outerwear is a puffer coat. Puffer coats are always my go-tos when it comes to outerwear, when it's like really freezing outside. I feel like they're kind of like the warmest, they're casual, they just kind of go with everything. They're probably the most practical, so I just love a good puffer coat. I just recently got one from Urban Outfitters and it is so warm, like so warm. It's this really soft kind of like fleece lined on the inside and it's really thick and puffy. I mean, it is genuinely so warm. It's a really good fit. It comes in cream, it comes in black, it comes in a bright blue color, um, but the cream and black are just really good neutrals that you can wear with anything. Princess Polly has a really has a lot of good puffer coats. I've got several puffer coats from Princess Polly that I absolutely love. I have a tan one that I just got that I've been wearing a ton. I have a black cropped kind of puffer coat that I love. They just have so many good ones. I also have a long black puffer coat from Urban Outfitters that I love. It like comes past my knees so it's really good when it's like freezing outside because it's a puffer and it's long um so if you live somewhere really cold i think a long puffer coat is also a good essential and then a long wool coat whenever you're wanting to look a little bit dressier a little bit nicer or just kind of like a cute outfit i think a long kind of it's not necessarily wool but like the wool look kind of coat. Um, i also have some from princess polly i have a bunch from boohoo they're all really nice and just like super cute and dressy you can literally just wear a plain top and then one of these coats and it just makes your outfit look so cute and dressed up i also really love aviator jackets i got one from forever 21 recently i don't know if aviator is even really the right style i don't know if it's, that's really what it's called but i think maybe it's what it's called but it looks like this and i feel like these are really warm because they have like the fur lining and they're just they're surprisingly warm like they look really stylish and cute but they're actually so warm like this one from forever 21 was like 35 dollars um and it's a super cute style last um and then my last recommendation for coats is a sherpa kind of jacket i recently got one from boohoo and i've been wearing it so much this one is also really really warm but you also look really cute and styled while wearing it i got a brown sherpa kind of style even like kind of like the teddy coats i guess would kind of fall into this category so like the teddy coats just like a sherpa kind of shirling kind of jacket any of those would be super cute and definitely an essential and then last but not least is accessories so i guess kind of a category within this category is shoes i think chunky boots like chunky black boots is definitely an essential um i recently got some boots from princess polly and i have been so so obsessed with these I feel like every year like I always black boots are kind of like my go-to and I feel like every year my black boots get like chunkier and chunkier and chunkier and I'm so obsessed with these like I've literally been wearing them every single day since I've gotten them from Princess Polly and I've gotten compliments like every single time I've worn these like out in public they are so cute They're actually really comfortable I recently worked a sales shift at American Eagle and I was wearing these and I was on my feet and my feet didn't hurt at all I was also out like a whole day just like running errands and my feet didn't hurt so I would say that these are actually really comfortable next up would be Uggs 
so on those really really cold days like whenever I was mentioning like I go to class and it's like negative temperatures I always go for my Uggs because they are so warm they're just gonna heat my feet way warmer than anything else so I love the Uggs but I have like a really casual outfit and I'm just like running errands or something I mean I know they're really expensive but they are so comfortable and cozy and warm um next up is sneakers I do really like sneakers and they're just like a good overall essential um I really like the Fila's people just always make fun of these but I personally love them like I love chunky obnoxious shoes Air Force ones are really cute as well um so any kind of cute sneakers are a great essential so that's pretty much it for shoes those are probably my three go-to shoes when it comes to the winter so now getting into the cold weather accessories beanies are definitely an essential um like i said on those really really cold days i love having a beanie to just kind of you know cover my ears and just keep my head warm these are great especially if you just want to have a lazy day and not really fix your hair i actually have a bunch from princess polly and they fit my do they just like fit my head better than a lot of other beanies i feel like some beanies just look like awkwardly small or awkwardly like there's like too much sticking up <laughs> just fit really good and they're nice and plain and they don't have like too much going on so i just really love those i have some other ones from h&m but they're just like random ones that i found on clearance in the store so i can't really link them um but h&m does have really good ones too next up is scarves scarves are a really good essential i feel like Again, I keep like referencing those like really cold days, um, but on really cold days when I would have to walk to class, I would always have a scarf because it does really just keep your neck and your like chin and face warm, which I guess now we have masks. Okay, so scarves are good. Gloves are good too. I love having warm gloves whenever I am walking around outside. I like the ones that have like fur lining. I have some from Urban Outfitters that are like fur lined and they're just super warm. I actually just got some from Princess Polly that are similar to that. They're like leather and so they look like really cute and dressy but they're also fur lined the last thing is jewelry i feel like you have to have good jewelry no matter the time of year um my favorite jewelry pieces are these earrings from Ana Luisa. you guys have definitely heard me talk about them these are the venus earrings i do have a link below that'll get you 10 percent off um and then i also have these other earrings from majuri you can see that they're just layered up those are probably my two favorite jewelry brands Ana Luisa is sustainable all their pieces are ethically made it's also really affordable and I've worn these earrings every day for at least at least six months all my pieces from Ana Luisa have just lasted really well I believe these are gold vermeil so they're just like gold coated and then my majority earrings are solid gold cannot tarnish I do have a link with them as well that will get you 10% off really good quality especially for the price both of those brands are my favorite I would definitely recommend checking them out I think that is everything and if you guys want to know more about my jewelry, I do have a whole jewelry collection video, so I will link that here. I think that's everything. Those are all my winter essentials. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed, and let me know if you'd like to see another one for the spring. And definitely comment down below what your winter essentials are and your favorite trends and places to shop. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Definitely make sure to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Turn on the notification bell. Follow me on Instagram at onlygrace.26. And Thumbs up this video if you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.